in the the word means to warn or caution someone of potential negative consequences such as a punishment as a result of certain behaviors and of course in the islamic and quranic context that negative consequence is the punishment of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala now it's very important to understand why allah subhanahu wa ta'ala uses this word and has uh, titled prophets as being mundirin, those who warn people. The reason is, is that a person is much more concerned and is primarily concerned with protecting the self from potential harms, more so than they are concerned with pursuing that which can bring a benefit. So if a person is between two choices, doing something that will come back with some sort of profit but will also result in uh, a certain harm, especially if that harm is greater than the Prophet, versus someone who can defend or protect themselves from that harm, but miss out on the potential Prophet. Humans will tend to choose the second. Why? Because our initial goal is to protect the self from harms, and then afterwards pursue the good. So in dar, in the Islamic context, is used to get the individual working towards that which will prevent any harms from uh, coming to the self. Assalamu alaikum wa